YouTube welcome back to my channel so you guys today I'm gonna be doing my son's starter locks now this is my first time doing comb coils but what made me do it was um, his dad didn't want to cut his hair um, he himself didn't want a haircut either he liked his hair but he's very very tender-headed and he always gives me a hard time doing his hair so we just thought okay we'll just lock it up because that way he still have his hair his hair won't be cut therefore everybody's happy especially me because honestly i got tired of fighting with him do, trying to do his hair so that's why we came to this conclusion and i think he'll be cute with it and he also liked the end result too so y'all will see later on through the video but anyways right here i um just sectioned off his hair from ear to ear you know just to um see what i'm doing and because his hair is very thick so i have to like do his hair in sections so i part his hair in half from ear to ear and then i section the top off and of course when you do starter locks you want to do it while their hair is wet so right here i have some warm water and i'm just spraying his hair because his hair was already drenched but with the warm water um i noticed that it helps keep his hair very um like a lot of slippage so it's like easier to work with and right here i have some uh tropical roots locking gel now and some clips now i will say about this locking and of course the comb sorry y'all my bad <laughs> and i will say about this locking gel is that it works pretty good but uh one thing that i didn't like about it was because i always read um, it said that it was like a warning on there and it said that this product can expose you to chemicals including lead which is known to the state of California to cause birth defects or other reproductive harm and I saw that and I was like eh mm -mm, we're not using this no more but um, at the time when I went to the beauty supply this was all I could find so that's what we're using but first and last time for sure so anyways, um, after I sectioned his hair off, I did me a part in the back, and then I'm going to section that top part off so I can see how that part looks. And then right here, I'm just cleaning it up. And you just do the parts however big you desire. If you want small locks, you do them teeny tiny, which I didn't want for him because his hair is already thick. And it would take me forever if I did, like, teeny tiny parts. So I tried to aim for medium small which I kind of did so you'll see and then I comb through his hair I put a little bit you don't really need too much of it just a little dime size on your finger of the um tropical roots locking gel and then I comb through it and then here we go to trying to uh, <laughs> attempting to do the comb coil with the comb so I section his hair off and then I start twisting it with the comb. Now I will say with the comb coil, so I try to do it like come at an angle and twist it. So I noticed that when I was doing it, like, okay, right here you can see I kind of had the hang of it, but then the hair slipped out. So if it's your first time doing this, just be patient with yourself. Don't get frustrated because I didn't expect it to be easy. I knew that it wasn't going to be as easy as it would look. But it's not really that hard either. You just have to, it's like a certain technique you got to have. But throughout doing doing his hair, I kind of got the hang of it. And, you know, I started doing a little bit faster. But I'm pretty sure the more I do them, you know, it'll come easy. But, yeah, I just comb coil all the way down to the ends. And then at the roots, uh, palm twisted it to get the roots to lay flat as much as I could and then of course we're going to use our clamps and I'm going to clamp it down so for the rest of this I'm just going to fast forward it and I'm going to let you guys watch me um, some parts of the clips will be in real time but for the most part after this one lot it will be fast forwarded and then I'll come back in and out to show you guys how everything looks Yep, that's it.
break, but we back. Oh, the camera that finna die. I'm gonna just come back when I finish with his hair. Full. Turn, look at the window. Turn your head towards the window. No, you can't do that. No. throughout the video I was struggling with the comb but I did get it finished and this is how the back looks um he did pretty good since still which I'm proud of and right here I'm gonna go in with the tropical roots oil I actually love this oil this oil is very moisturizing um it's kind of a thick oil which is good for his hair because his hair soaks up moisture very much but I'm gonna spray that on there and yeah, I made it through. I struggled. I know y'all saw it. I did um one of the clips in real time to show that yeah, the struggle was real, <laughs> but I got through this. Um I think it took me about maybe 3 or 4 hours to finish because we actually took like a 2 hour break. So I think it took me about maybe 3 and a half, maybe 4 hours to do it. Which actually wasn't that bad cuz I was I don't know what I was expecting. Especially because I was struggling. I wasn't expecting it to be that fast. But yeah, this is the end result of his parts. And right here, I actually was satisfied with the way it looked. But after it dried, I did the um, barrel twist. And I noticed that his parts were kind of bigger than my liking. So I actually went back in, um, cleaned up his parts, and made his parts a little bit smaller which I'm getting ready to show in a second. But they looked so cute on him. He looked so handsome. Um, after this clip, I actually let him go in the bathroom and see him. Shake your head. Do it again. Good job. The video because I definitely did this the next day I went back I made his part smaller as you can see and I did them more um, I cleaned them up in the front like so I made the um, parts more square yep that's the end result so thank you guys so much for watching and I will see y'all on the next video bye